KLYC, and one of the many fun things you can do this weekend is you can go to Newburgh and check out the Camellia Festival. And on the phone with us right now is Caleb Thurston. He is with the Shehalem Cultural Center in Newburgh. Caleb, thanks for joining us on KLYC. Absolutely, my pleasure. So tell us about the Camellia Festival. What are you going to be doing tomorrow? Well, it's the sixth annual Camellia Festival. Camellia is the official city flower for Newburgh. So it's a great opportunity to celebrate spring and uh, all the blooms that are happening around town. Uh, it's also a, a chance to celebrate the Asian roots of, of the camellia plant. And so we have performers and uh, demonstrations all around this, this Asian Pacific Rim theme. So we have uh, taiko drummers. We have uh, Lee's lion and dragon dancers. So there's something for everybody. There's vendors, food, and art activities for kids. There's a run in the morning, a 5K and a 10K, uh, starting at 9 a.m. And, uh, of course, the, the highlight is the, the Oregon Camellia Society's Bloom Show. Now, the Camellia Festival, uh, how many mm -hmm. people generally attend? Uh, last year we had over 2,000 people come through the doors, and this year we're expecting even more, especially with this beautiful Oregon spring weather. Oh, it's gorgeous. Is there an admission cost? There is not. It's absolutely free uh, for all ages. And the hours again and where they need to show up? It's 10 to 4, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Uh, in the forecourt of the Shehalem Cultural Center in downtown Newburgh. Looking forward to being there. Caleb Thurston is with the Shehalem Cultural Center in Newburgh, and if you're looking for something to do, check it out. Thanks, Caleb. Thank you. AM 1260 KLYC.